Hey everyone, I'm Matt. Welcome back to another video. Today, I am super excited. We have a very special edition of Matt's RV Reviews. Behind me is the Columbia Northwest A-Liner. We're here at the dealership and we're gonna take a look at all of them because they're so small. Also, we're gonna demonstrate how easy it is to set it up and to put it down. We're starting in three, two, one. Everyone again, welcome back to another video. My name is Matt from Matt's and Will's RV Reviews Tobles. It's World's Only Channel giving you a true unbiased review about everything when it comes to RVs. And again, today I am super excited. We finally found a Columbia Northwest A liner. And Will, we didn't find one of them, we found like six or seven of them. Yeah, we hit the jackpot. Yeah, so I'm super excited to show everybody. But before I begin, I would like to say hi to Will. Hey Will! Hey guys! How's it going? It's going good. Where are we at today? We are at Carolina Coach in North Carolina. I forget what city. Do you remember? Claremont? I don't know what city. Claremont, I think. North Carolina. Yeah, <laughs> um, but it's a beautiful dealership here, beautiful day. And uh, Matt, what's that on your shirt say? Yeah, yeah, it says uh, RV Complete. If you guys haven't seen the big announcement, we've now partnered with RV Retailer, which is a nationwide network of dealerships, Carolina Coach being one of the dealerships in their network. So we're super excited to be partnering with them. And uh, Again, because of that, if you guys saw in our announcement, nothing's changed. We just now have the ability to go to all these different dealerships and show you wicked cool products like this. Yeah. So Will, what we're gonna do before we show everybody the insides, I wanna show everybody, I wanna introduce everybody to Brett, the general manager of this location, and he's gonna show us how easy it is to open and to close this thing. Okay. Great, so before we take a look at all the different floor plans, I'm here with Brett the general manager of Carolina Coach. Brett, thank you so much for uh, having us today. Oh yeah, great to have you here, thank you. So, so tell us just a little bit about Columbia Northwest and A-Liner and what this product is. A-Liner is a fantastic lightweight towable. It's meant to fold down, and so when you're towing something that's light, you don't feel like you have something cumbersome behind you. You're not tent camping, you're off the ground. Columbia Northwest has been in business for 36 years. Wow. They're not mass produced in Elkhart, Indiana. Okay. They're made specifically at a plant in Pennsylvania. Okay. The frames are made specifically just for the A-liner. Yeah. They're not used for cargo trailers or other types of trailers. They're made just for this. Um, they do Asdell siding. We love Asdell. Um, Off-road is available. Okay. So you can go off-grid with this unit too because you're going to have heat and AC when you're plugged in. But you always got to look because they'll make them without it for whatever your needs are. But when you see this on this side, you know you have furnace heat. Yes. So you've got your battery for lights, you'll have heat, and you can go off grid. Of course, you'd have 30 amp if you were at a park with power or at home. You could do what we've done, take it down to 110 just to have your lights going. Perfect. You do have the option of hard and soft dormers. Okay. I do recommend hard dormers if you're going to bear country. Yes. <laughs> and um, it's, it doesn't really add much weight. It adds a little to the cost. They also have assist for up and down, but uh, our rep, his name's Gordon Baker. He can put one of these up and down about 30 to 45 seconds. It takes me two minutes. Perfect. Well, we're excited. We, we are about to put it up and down, but uh, how many different floor plans do they have of these? Uh, they have a, a variety of floor plans. You've got a small Scout Light Ranger 10. You can go up to, to larger ones, the LXC, that'll have a cassette toilet and a classic. So you're probably looking at about eight to 10 different floor plans. Wow, and, and what I love about Carolina Coach, you guys stock all eight to 10? We do. We do. When they have them, you know, but you know, I, I know a lot of dealerships, they, they always like to have the most popular two or three. And, and here, I mean, they're, they're spread out all over the place. So we're gonna, we're gonna be taking a look at all of them, but uh, can you show us generally, are they all gonna open and close the same generally? Yes, they are. Perfect. They are. So, we'll so start how do we inside. close it? We'll start inside. Oh, okay. Come on, man. Should I be in there with you? You sure can. Okay. Um, another advantage of uh, A-liners while we're inside is uh, you can slate two, four, um, you could take kids with you and they could set up a tent outside. There's so many options that you can use. Whenever you have dormers, you're gonna do the dormers first. Uh, so these will fold in. Will, look at your head height. I know, plenty of head height. Okay. And that's the advantage of dormers is you can use the bed and uh, the dinette inside. Mm -hmm. So here we go. Okay. There we go. And we'll lock that up in the back. Once we have those closed up, we can lock, we can push in the back as well. The main thing is to have these first two down. Okay. 
So that down. Wow. And then that pulls down. There we go. Perfect. So we'll go finish locking up the outside and then we can go ahead and do the inside. Okay, so these are the dormers. Yep, we can stretch it down a little bit. Okay. This one's getting held, held up by the curtains a little bit. Oh, okay. okay. It's a lot easier than that. Oh, wow. So they're designed not to leak. It's all overlapping. You can see this handle here. So a lot of people live in a homeowner's association. And with this handle, you're going to be able to push it in and out of your garage. They all come with a spare tire. Um, on the other side... Look at those tires, Will. <laughs> on the other side, if you notice, there was um, a quick connect for your gas so that you can, you can also do your barbecue in there, too. Okay, so they're all going to open and close this general way. First, you're going to do your dormers. The soft dormers, um, you'll be able to do everything from inside. The hard dormers, you're going to have to let the uh, in, down inside, come outside, do your latches, and then go back inside and put the A-frame down. The ones without dormers, the units without dormers, and the ones with dormers, once you're at this point, will close the same way. Okay. Perfect. Can you make it, Bill? Yeah, I think so. Nice. Always undo your door, and you'll see why in a second. Okay, so he just twisted that off the door. Turn the lights off for that. Okay, so you always do your back wall first. Okay. Hold that there, unlatch this one. Then you're gonna bring your back wall down okay. so that it comes at your back. Yep. Okay. Step on out, Will, for us. Okay. Yep. I'm gonna step out too. And then it'll be at your back in this way. Nothing will be able to fall down on you. Okay. Oh. Then you'll do your final latch here. Oh, there's the door. Oh, holy wow. smokes. That is so cool. <laughs> then you come here, do that. And then we'll probably do the store last as, as we let the sides down. As you can see, this is a wind assist so that if it was locked into this position and some winds and weather going through, it would help keep it steady, but also it helps people that aren't as tall to be able to put it down. So but what you want to do here is just get the top a little started, okay. and then it'll just work its way on its own for gravity, with gravity. So there you go. Then you have the same latches on each side. This one will close that, and overlap. There you go. Just like that. Just like that. So what I want to do after we get this latched up and you can see it all the way around, I'm going to open it up in about uh, a minute's time or less and show you how quick it is. Oh, we're okay. going to put the timer on. You hear that, Jen? <laughs> Set a one minute timer. But look at this. Will, stand next to it. Yep. This is shorter than Will. It is. This Crazy. is perfect for garages and everything. It's one of those things, personally, as an RVer myself, I always live by the rule, friends don't let friends buy canvas. You know what I'm saying? So this, having that hard wall side is pretty neat. Yeah, it is. It's awesome. And uh, it still keeps it lightweight. It keeps it small. And you're not sleeping in a tent. Wow. Cool. So you ready to get it popped up? Oh, yes. Okay, Jen, set the timer. Go. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I couldn't yeah. do that. I am going to show you wind assist since we're making good time here. That'll go here. Oh. So it'll help you it into the lock position. Ah, but it okay. Also, it'll lock in here to help you if a little wind's going through. Because when you're camping, you're outside. Right. If it starts raining, you might go inside for a little bit and, of course, sleep in at night. And everybody knows when you get to the campground in one of these, it's always going to be raining. <laughs> it never fails, right? There you go. Well, I saw somebody camping with the pop-up the other day with the canvas pop-up and all that, and I thought, oh my goodness, wouldn't it, wouldn't it be awesome if they had a something 
blocked on that side. If so, if they oh. had a uh, A liner, was it locked? Yeah. That's a time penalty. There we go. The timer going off. We all time made it. time penalty. There we go. There we go. Still super fast. Amazing. I say that's pretty dang good. What do you say, Will? Yeah, for sure. I think we went a little over, but he showed us some extras too. It's okay. So. Yeah, exactly. Some exactly. Credit. There's a time credit there too. There you go. Very, very cool. Brent, thank you so much for uh, hosting us today and, and being on video and showing us how to set up the A-liner. Absolutely. Thank Anything you. you want to say to America? Uh, thank you. Uh, welcome to Carolina Coach and beautiful North Carolina. Yes, sir. Thank you. Great. Thanks so much, Brett. We really do appreciate you showing us this. So, Will, now we're going to take a look at just all of them and just pop in and out and literally spend a few seconds in each one. Okay. First and foremost, Will, look at these tires. They're the Patagonia tires. Ooh. I've never seen those. Uh, this is the A-liner with the off-road package. And let's take a look at the inside. Okay. So, uh, Brett was saying this was one of the biggest ones out there. And as you guys saw, this is what's insane. Will has plenty of yeah, headspace in here. Great, I can stand here, cook, do dishes, get to the fridge. Um, oh, this one has a little cassette toilet. Oh man, here we go, I'm Will. Do the test. Yeah. I don't think it's gonna pass though. <laughs> Plastic, womp womp. Uh, Will, believe it or not, it's not a prime pooping position. Right. But again, for an A-frame, it's the best toilet I've right. ever been on. For any sort of pop-up hybrid. Yeah, it's exactly. It's the best. So you have your dinette set up over there. Right here. Again, nice little kitchen. And then here's your bench area and this does, it does convert into a sleeper. Very nice. And again, plenty of power, USB. You have a furnace. You have that side mount AC unit. So it's a low profile and it has the off-road package. Let's take a look at the next one. All right. We're just gonna keep it rolling. If you guys don't subscribe to Will and Jen's channel, make sure you subscribe to their channel and you can see Will's brand new GMC Denali. <laughs> well, new used. Yeah. 2016, right? 15. 2015. Cool, so uh, this one here. Oh, is this the classic? This might be the classic. Yeah, it's the classic. Okay, he said this is their number one seller. Got it. Okay, and it also does have the off-road tires. Okay. So, okay, so this is the classic. Again, very similar to the other one, just a lot smaller footprint, a lot lighter. Right here, we do have the dinette. In a smaller kitchen, also no cassette toilet. Right. That's what it is. Right there, you do have the microwave convection oven. Jump out. Or the microwave right there. Right there. And then here, really struggling there. Dang right, America. <laughs> Very nice. It becomes a sofa. Again, 100,000 times better. Not my cup of tea, but 100,000 times better than a pop-up. You know That's what I'm saying? Right. This is getting you off the ground. This is getting you completely enclosed. You're not going to get wet. Um, so it's pretty cool. Cool. And very lightweight, easy to tow. And what's also real good about it is, um, you know, for city people, being able to keep it in your garage. Right, that was something he touched on. If you have an HOA or something and need to be able to put it in your garage, you can get this in. I think if like, if I had a son and he was in Boy Scouts and yeah. they're out tent camping, That's it's like, sleep all in. right, kids. Good night. <laughs> you guys have a good night. I'm gonna set up in my tent. So this was the one that Brett demonstrated to us. But again, let's just pop in and out real just quick. quick. Dinette right here, kitchen, very similar to the last one we just showed actually with no toilet. Right. Maybe this might be the same floor plan. Yeah, it might be. It's crazy how they can make, in such a small RV, they can make different floor plans. I know. It's like, how many different ways can you configure a small little space? Okay, and this is just like the first one we went in. Okay. With the kitchen, the toilet and everything. Okay, perfect, not a problem. Oh, okay, just some storage. Yeah, nice and then kitchen. there's another one right there. Okay. This one's different. Okay, this one's different. So does this lift? It's like a front kitchen, yep. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, that is a nice like toilet a wet area. Bath. 
Yeah, like a wet bath. Cause like oh, be okay. So you, yeah, this is for hanging the shower curtain. Yep. Little kitchen here. And then this one, I guess, only has one sleeping area. Yeah. Right here. Can you drop this down? Yep. And then, Will, I, I believe they do have one more in the showroom, so okay. let's kick it over to that. Cool, so here's the A-Line Arranger, and this one does have the that optional canvas side that Brett was talking about. A little bit of storage, man, you know, just getting it done. Yeah. These are the uh, oh, yeah, those Patagonia are tires great. again. And then, just so everybody can see, now that we're in the showroom and we have good lighting, this is what that side AC unit looks like. Spare tire, spare tire carrier. You know, just really simple. Potable water fill. Potable, potable. It's so awkward in showrooms, especially right. when we don't know people. So, outdoor shower, little solar hookup. Did you see the dry weight on the side of this too? They no. put a sticker, 1859. I love it. Tongue weight's 153 pounds. Perfect, going in well. Okay. All right, let me back up a little. Nice little dinette here. Small kitchen. Um, the bed area turns into a couch. Very nice. Again, nice little sink, little cooktop, little furnace and refrigerator. Simple. Yep, just very simple and nice. Cool, back outside. Back to outside. Great, so those were all the different A-liners from Columbia Northwest. Big shout out to Carolina Coach, who is part of our nationwide dealership network. And again, if you guys are interested in any of these A-liners, go to mattsrvreviews.com. There you'll see the contact tabs. If you're ready to buy this, click tab number one. Again, we have a nationwide network of almost 100 dealerships. So we're gonna hook you up with the closest dealership to you that has A-liner. It might be Carolina Coach, it might be somewhere out west. We don't know, it's all based off your zip code. Right. Will, is there anything you wanna say? Yeah, of course, thank you all so much. And he, again, huge thanks to Carolina Coach here in North Carolina. They have a beautiful dealership. So um, if you're in the area, wanna check some units out, let them know that you saw our videos and they'll take great care of you. Thank you absolutely everybody yes. so much for watching and Will, we'll see you next time.